What's up everyone, welcome back for more Ocarina of Time, and in special, welcome back for more Forest Temple. In the last episode, I started this wicked dungeon, and I'm gonna shoot this eye, and... Make the room normal, again. Normal, between brackets, that is. Anyways, um, Let's see what changed here, because we changed the place. And, ooh, look at that. The chest is now down. Oh my god. Yeah, that is a wall mask, and you really don't want to get grabbed by those. Really, you don't want that. Because if you get grabbed, you'll be sent all the way back to the dungeon, like I said before. And we got the boss key, now we can lurk into the chamber where the boss remains. And I'm gonna drop down. this one. Door opens, yay. And there's nothing else here which I need, so I can go on. Alright, so now we're out here. Die. Die. die, just die. There's nothing there. And there's a door here. Let's open it. And oh my. Oh, all my stuff. Oh. Bye. This one will... Just do it like this. Just do a spin attack and it's gone. It, I was gonna say, it splits up into small pieces. And this should be small key. And it is a small key. Sweet. Which means I should be able to open the door which we were in before. Nice. Anyways, let's go in here. And we land up here. I'll just take that one out. There we go. And now pretty much what I gotta do is run all the way back up to open the door. You know, the one we uh, been in through. Hmm. Yeah, is there anything special to say? I don't think there's anything particular for you to uh, know about me or anything. Oh, wait a minute. I think there should be a... Was it here? Yeah. Should the eye up here, which I mentioned earlier. And it just drops. And what's in the chest? Something good? Well, decent. More arrows. Ah oh well. We can carry up to 30 right now. Soon, after the first temple, we can wear more. Anyways, let's go up. Where, 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 where? Mm, got a small thing to climb. And in here, and I'll ignore those. But in order to reach the place, we need room to be back into distortion again. So pretty much reshoot the eye, don't forget, else you were not able to reach the room. And go here. And now you can pretty much cross over. Like that. And that's it. Here. Oh, oops. Hmm, I might make this a three-part dungeon. I'm not really sure if I can make it in time, actually. Force Temple is rumored for being pretty long and could be pretty confusing if you don't know what you're doing. <laughs> but that's usually the case. Anyways, we should be here. Should we? Yeah, pretty much jump over. For some reason I don't seem to make a jump. Pretty sad. Um, I'm gonna ignore those dudes, I guess. Yeah, I'll pretty much ignore them. They're not that special. And I'll open the door. And we can hit this room. And the purpose of this room is to hit the eye up there, and since it's frozen, we need to do a little trick. What I'm gonna try to do in one shot is... Aim for the eye. And... Fire! Bullseye! Straight in the eye! Actually in the eyelid, but it's an awesome shot, I must say. And now the regular room becomes distorted. So let's go back. And pretty much ignore these guys again, they're a little bit tough to avoid, but they're still pretty easy. Now let's just... Is there anything, don't forget, to double check, there's nothing here, let's go. And we're in some sort of checkered room, but watch out for that ceiling. Nothing we pretty much warned us here. Watch out, the ceiling is falling down. 
And if you get hit, oh, that hurts. And there's those fuckers are to be taken care of as well. But if you do it right, you should be able to go here. Open the door, make sure you're still safe. And cross over as soon as you can. Open the chest. Arrows. Pretty much stay on the same spot if you get hit. Yeah, you're pretty much getting sent back, I guess. Something we don't want. And we're in this room with a large um, painting. There are shadows. There are blocks up there. So, anyways, shoot it. This thing drops. You're pretty much gonna make the puzzle in a minute. Well, it's not really that difficult, but you gotta keep moving. First, most important thing is to get that block out of the way. Now, this should be fine. Remember, it's as long as you keep moving, there should be no problem. It's already in the correct uh, position, you don't need to swap stuff or anything, you just need to push those blocks together. And as you can see, I got half of it completed already and almost won uh, 3 out of 4. Half time, 3 out of 4 completed, so now I gotta pretty much get it fixed. This one. Oh, move it a little bit there. And see, I got plenty of time left. Like, um, done. Now it appears, and we get the battle going on with this dude. And he's exactly the same as all the others. But what you gotta do, keep your distance, keep your distance. Once it appears, slide for it. And you should be able to do it, it's just like the other ones. And there we go. So we got three of those guys already, and we need one more, of course. Door opens, let's get the um, missing arrow. And... Oh, a heart. Anyways, I'll put my bit in that. And we're back in the main corridor again. We're back. And if we look down there, there's a boss. Can I hit it already? Oh, oops. No, it doesn't work. Let's just approach it. And it's the fourth one, but it will split up. And it's not that difficult. But you can't hit this one, so you really gotta use your arrows here. Technically, they all, all appear. Like this. One of them makes an extra sprint, that's the real one. And pretty much all you gotta do is, is shoot the real one with a uh, bow shot. So just rinse and repeat the strategy, this is really easy, I don't even consider this a mini boss. Even though it has the boss move. It really is no big deal. If you're too slow and he'll start dashing at you, make sure you run away. But yeah, that's pretty uh, calm. And there we go. So this one disappears, flame appears, and we can pretty much go down again. So let's just do that, shall we? Now let me see if I forgot the skull shell piece, because I remember we need it. Um, yeah, I actually forgot one, wow. Um, it is in the room after playing the boss key, it's near a wall, so I'll just get that one off screen. Ugh, I feel so stupid. I actually forgot that. Anyways, there is one here. Let's see, can I already see it? I believe it is behind the wall, so I'll just push it. If you push the wall, it will rotate around you and go in somewhere. Let's see, there's one. This one can die, and up here is my fourth, which should have been my fifth. It's got to at least. Once again, the other one is near the boss um, key door on a wall. And I got the arrows, sweet. Ugh. Was, I was pushing this one, wasn't I? Yeah. Pretty much check every wall you can enter or exit. Because there are a lot of split roads here. And it's actually pretty fast forward if you just keep moving on. So let's see, this room is blocked. This room is blocked, so this is not good. Yet. So I'll push it again. 
something out here. No. A switch. So, hmm. Seems like the one we just did. So let's see, can I push this? And pretty much turn it the same way back. Yeah, we can. And another door opens, which we haven't seen yet. So I'm pretty much gonna go here again and push the wall again. Let me readjust my mic. There. This shouldn't really have any way to go. We've been here, so let's go on. Let's see. Is there something here now? No, it's black. There's something up there. A switch. Sweet. Let's press it. And if I am correct, that should be the door to the final boss. Um, hmm. You know what? I got time left. I'll skip ahead to the part where the actual fifth sculpture is, and I'll see you guys there. See you in a moment. Alright, remember here? The place where... Yeah, it battled the wall master before? I forgot the sculpture here. If you go up here... And cross over and get the heart... Then up here is... The missing sculpture piece, which I couldn't get before. Well, actually, I could have got it, but I forgot. So, can I kill this one quickly? Oh, that would have been if I could have killed it for that. Hmm. Yeah, that pretty much sums up the forest temple. The only thing I still have to do is beat the boss. But that shouldn't be that difficult, I guess. I haven't revealed the boss to you yet, so we will just have to wait for the next episode. And yes, I am gonna cut it off here. So in the next episode, the boss of the forest temple. What could it be? And what happened to Saria? Find out soon. See you guys then, and thanks for watching.